Yo guys, what is up? It's Nick. We are back on the Dark Souls 3. We are going to be starting up the fun run, fun playthrough, whatever you want to call it. Uh, summoning people, doing co-op, PvP, whatever. Just having some fun in this playthrough. If you want a more difficult, challenging playthrough, I'll be doing the Artorias of the Abyss cosplay on New Game Plus starting sometime soon around when I start this one on the channel. So keep an eye out for that. Uh, these will all be like one video a day. Um, done with the three videos for one playthrough in a day. We'll be finishing up the Quantum Break on Hard and all of that good stuff. Uh, but let's get this started and allow for uh, the opening cutscene to play. Yes, indeed. It is called Lothric. Where the transitory lands of the Lords of Cinder converge. In venturing north, the pilgrims discover the truth of the old words. The fire fades, and the lords go without thrones. Undead Legion, the Abyss Watchers. And the reclusive Lord of the Profaned Capital. Yon the Giant. will abandon their thrones. And the unkindled will rise. Nameless, accursed, undead, unfit even to be cinder. So it is that Ash seeketh embers. All right, guys, I think I know what build I'm going with and all of that stuff. We're going to start as the knight again, but we are going to be using magic in this playthrough. Uh, but we're going to start as the knight. I just think it's the best starting class. We're going to take the young white branch. Um, and now it's time to do this part. Appearance. Alright, all I care about base skin color. We're going blue. We're going to be blue. I think this is the correct to get the blue that I want. Yep, right there. There's that blue. Uh, face details. Hair. I want this hair, and we want some blue hair. Actually, do I want blue hair? I kind of want yellow, but how do you make yellow? Okay, there's green. Do I add red to make yellow? Yeah, I do. There we go. There we go! And then if I go... This makes white hair, right? Yeah, that's white-ish hair. It's not really completely white, but... 
Yeah, right there. Yellow and blue. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> that looks ridiculous. Can I get some, like, bushy eyebrows going on here? Give me these bushy eyebrows. Let me make them yellow. Uh, you can't really see them. Eh. Yeah, that might not be worth it. You can't really see them. They're not bushy enough. They're not really bushy enough. I could go no eyebrows. Actually, I want no eyebrows. That looks good with the, with it all being all blue. No eyebrows. Okay. I think we might be good. Could go no eyelashes. That looks weird, though. Actually, can't even see the eyelashes. Um, now eyes. Color of pupils. There's like a black. Can I have a black? Actually, it really doesn't matter because you really can't see them. They're not... Let's see here. Is there anything good that I can put on my face? Um, I kind of want to put this on my face. It kind of looks decent. Could go with that over my eyes, but eh. You could put these over both your eyes. I think that's the point of that. I don't know what the point of some of these down here are, but... Oh, these are like scars. Um, put this on my cheek. Down. To the right. Could put them there if I wanted to. I don't really want to. I don't want a tattoo. Alright, there we go. Blue man. Yellowish hair. We're good to go. Anything that I want to change... No, I will be, I'll be standard. Okay. Oh, I gotta put a name in. Uh, let's just put my YouTube. I would put King Reject, but this isn't, I don't think that's this build. So let's put my YouTube in. Why not? This will help me remember, I guess, which character this is, but let's get this started. I'm ready to go. Actually, pretty excited for this. Should be fun. Where's the bell? There it is. The blue hand coming up. <laughs> oh, that was good. That first hand that came out was blue. It didn't have the armor. <laughs> Been having that issue with armors not loading. It was like a fraction of a second where my hand was sticking out all blue. Alright, here we go. I gotta take this helmet off. We gotta be able to say my beautiful hair and head. I kinda just wanna take the full armor off, but... Can you fast roll with the helmet on? I don't even remember this. And look, the helmet didn't roll. Look, there it goes as I roll. I'm just gonna run by everything, because nothing here is important. Yeah, shoot your arrow. We'll come back for the crystal lizard, because there's, there's no use for it right now. I don't need it. Well, this sword is pretty good. I forgot about all of this. It's been a while since I started the game over. Um, the only other time I started over, I started with a mage, like I was going pure mage build. Uh, light this up. I'm online, right? I think I am. I need to be online, I guess, is what I'm saying. Alright. So we're gonna go this way. I'm not gonna mess with a lot of these guys, a lot of these enemies. There we go. Did that guy dropped something up there. I think he did, but... I think it's just a fading soul, or at best it's a cleric sacred chime, which also isn't really... How did this guy die? There we go. Alright, he's dead. Here we go. Ludex gun near time. Isn't there an... I thought there was an item back there. I guess not. Here we go. Let me take this off. I don't need that white branch on. Okay. Here we go. To hand the sword. Gotta kill him here. I don't wanna 
I wanna die. Dude, why'd I kick? And I got hit. I got hit. Okay, there we go. Okay. Regather myself here. What? That is stupid. That is stupid too. And I didn't get my one. That one. Oh my god, dude. I suck. I suck. Dude, I'm so sick of delayed attacks with enemies in this game. Like, cut that. What? The... Dude, why did he all of a sudden burst like that? I thought he had the... I thought you... God, I just gotta hit him once. There we go. <laughs> if I would have died there, that would have been embarrassing. Alright, coiled sword. Light up the bonfire. I guess I'll take a rest real quick. Give me my souls. Alright, and away we go. There we go. At least I killed him first time this time, because of my stupid Let's Play. Every time that I fought him, I fought him like four times total. Um, or on, I guess four different playthroughs. Because I did my first test one, this one, uh, the Let's Play, and then I was at a friend's house and I just started a character on there for the heck of it. Uh, and I've killed him first time every time except on the stupid Let's Play, which is always how it happens. Okay, yeah, there's the dog around this corner, right? Yeah. I think there are a couple items that I want to grab around here. Yeah, ember, I want those. Once I get into the main areas and can start summoning people, I'll do more, I guess, gradual grabbing of items. But in this opening area, there's not really that many items, so I don't even really need to worry about it. Item here, east-west shield. Oh god. Stop it. I guess we'll kill the the uh, Uchi Katana guy. I don't want the Uchi Katana in this playthrough, because we've literally used it for the whole entire playthrough. What are you doing? But we'll kill him, because he does give me some souls. Come here. Come back to- what are you doing? Ah! Okay, run away and heal. What you doing? Get my stand in the back. Against this guy, it really only takes one little screw up for you to get killed. But you literally, he's got no poise. There we go, a little poke. There we go. I think there's an ember up here for me. Yes, there is. Is there an item around here? Yep. Homeward Bone. I think that's all the items out here of use. Alright, let's head into Firelink Shrine. There we go, Firelink Shrine. Drop on down, we've got Andre. I don't really think I need to talk to anybody. <laughs> Uh, let me grab this. 
There are, I guess there is a couple things I should probably grab while I'm here. Um. Um. I guess I'll grab this. You can buy unlimited amount of torches. Let's see. Soul Arrow or Farron Dart? Which one? Farron Dart is cheaper, like FP wise, but. Do I have enough to buy all of this crap? Yeah, I do. I can buy that. I can buy both. And then buy this. I guess I'll buy heat. Eh, no, I don't need to buy heal aid. Okay, I think we're good. Ashen one. Yeah, Ashen one, bring you souls. We don't need her dialogue. Like, I think we've all heard that a million times. Also, probably don't need Andre's, but we'll do it. I don't even think I need to talk to her. Can't I, can I just travel on out of here? There we go. Rest at the bonfire. And we can go ahead and head on out to High Wall of Lothric. So we can get this going pretty quickly here. Don't need to lollygag around for too long. Oni Slayer, Great Arrow. I kind of want to get a Great Bow in this playthrough just to, just to use it. Hopefully, I will see some summon signs when we get here, because that's the whole point of this playthrough, is to summon people, so hopefully hopefully I don't go without finding summon signs. I might in the early areas, I don't know. The game is still fairly fresh, though. Once it's been out two weeks today, I think it's two weeks today, people should still be really into the game right now. Okay. We're here. If you save and quit, I did find out you get, you go through these doors. Not that that is any sort of time saver, but it is if you speed run the game. All right, there's a bonfire. I don't care if I lose some health rolling down here. Yep, we've got plenty of summon signs. Good stuff. I'm gonna go ahead and rest, and let's pull some people in, Mac. We got like a sorcerer. Kind of want to bring in like a sorcerer. Sure, Alenthus. Okay, we've got two people coming in now. Should be good to go. I'm not gonna wave and gesture to every single person. Like that gets you get really sick really fast of gestures if you co-op enough because people like dick around and gesture like a million times, and I'm like, yes, I get it. We're in the same game. Okay, I'm gonna go. You guys should come with me. Okay, let's just go. See? See, it turns into a gesture fest. And it gets really annoying really fast. I need to die. I don't know what I'm gonna do there, because I need to get those dark sigils, because I'm doing that ending. Since I don't care about going hollowing with a male character, that's what we're doing. Come here. What are you doing? I'm gonna go up top. I wanna grab the timer. What is this enemy doing? This is the stupidest AI I've ever seen in my entire life. What is he doing? Okay, they can clear that out, I guess. I just wanna come up here and grab an item. They're not here. I thought there was... Okay, the binoculars are up there. I don't need those. I just wanted this. The gold pine resin. Are there any items in this room? I don't even remember. Oh yeah, there is. Oh wait, no. Yeah, there is some right here. Fire bombs. All right, down we go. We're just gonna drop to there, down to here. Could pick up the claymore. That'd be something different for me to use. Um, come here. Kick. I one-shot him like this. Alright, that's nice. Okay, the issue is, is I want this... I'm gonna run. Wait. Go, 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 go! Go for it! Get the claymore! Get the claymore! I can't heal. Roll, roll, drop. 
Okay, whatever, gravity. I still did it. I got my weapon. Okay, um... Ow! Okay, I'm gonna jump down and run across. This is the one issue with this area is now that my co-ops are probably gonna come running behind me and probably get torched. Got no land. Well, those guys are gonna die if they don't haul ass over here. Okay, that's not exactly what you're supposed to do there, but that's fine for them. Oh yeah, we've got nine dude now. The poor knight's getting gay. Okay. I know I said I wasn't gonna kill everything, but... I guess we are a little bit. I don't think I can open this, right? Yeah, it doesn't open. Okay, so we gotta go this way. Let's go... Item over here. Fire bombs. I'm gonna run up top real quick and light the bonfire. So light this up. And back down we go. Okay, that's the way we're supposed to go. Down there is... is that strong enemy. It's, just the, it's the strong enemy, and then it's that cage, which I don't have a cage key, so it doesn't even matter. So we're gonna go this way. Item over here. Kill this guy. What the heck? Okay! I don't know why I couldn't hit him on the ladder. Yeah, dude up there, kill him. Okay, I'm gonna go try to kill the Chaos guy first before he can even transform. I don't think I got- I didn't get him in time. Oh, God. Yeah, Mac, you and your no health, go get him. Hey, run away for a second. Alright, this is not good. I think he's dead, but I'm all- No, he's not, and I'm dead. Really? Game, really? Oh well. I, I, where I got the bonfire now is past the stupid dragon, so we don't have to dick with that anymore. Because that's where I lost my health, and then they lost their health trying to follow me. That part's annoying for co-op. It's not a good- it, It's good- It's well designed for- like you for like a, if you're playing yourself like through but it's not good if you have co-ops like it's really bad when you have co-ops which always sucks but we should be good to go now up here i'll record for a little bit longer this is gonna suck now i can't die a lot because see that's the issue i need to die but i can't die <laughs> i'm just gonna have to do uh a cheesy way to get the the deaths. I'm just gonna jump off at Firelink and die repeatedly until I can keep leveling up with that before he disappears and dies. I think that other summon is screwed up. I've been having problems co oping just for fun and also like getting summoned in the games where it won't summon the person but it'll be like they're in your world. So it really is stupid. Like, it's messed up right now. It's acting as if she's in that the Lady Valkyrie that I su or summoned. It's acting like she's in the game when she's really not in the game. And it never actually fixes itself.
It's like the game knows it fucked up, but it can't figure out how to fix it. There we go. Unable to summon Phantom. Yeah, see, it's all monkey jacked up again, because now I can't rest. This is so annoying. Um, What did I want to do? I wanted to check that Claymore. Can I use it? I don't have- no, it takes 13 decks, really? To use the Claymore? Alright, this is when this gets annoying, is when I can't summon people. So that defeats the point of this playthrough being one that I can summon people if I don't summon anybody. Okay, yeah, see, it's like all unable to summon. And now it doesn't let me rest at bonfires. It's just annoying. They really need to patch this. Because it doesn't let you s it doesn't let you rest. <laughs> so it's like screwed up. And then if you try to if you die, this game will never load. It just it gets stuck. It gets stuck in like this infinite loop. Okay, okay, knight. Come here. I don't want to fight you in here. Come up here. Oh look. It's gonna say unable to summon Phantom, probably. There's that covenant where, um... Oh, it actually worked this time. Ah, oh, god. God damn it, dude. God, I fucking hate these knights. And I don't know where the hell the guy that I summoned is. He's not even fucking anywhere near. I hate these knights early game. They're so fucking annoying. Like, so annoying. I have no potions again, though. So I almost just want to... I don't know where this guy went. I'm just going to send him home. Because I don't even know what he's doing. So I'm just going to send him home. So we can rest at this stupid bonfire. And I think that should do it for episode one. I think that's a nice ending place. These are the guys that can either be friendly or enemy. Um, depending on however they choose to play it. Uh, but that's gonna do it, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. Uh, drop a like if you did, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll catch you guys in part two of the fun run. Uh, so I'll catch you guys then. Peace out.